like to just introduce uh, DA Tom Zugabe and, and fill us in on what your office does and how they can help. Thank you, Greg, very much. Um, good evening, everyone, and thanks for being here. I think we should all um, congratulate Prudential Rand for taking their leadership role here tonight. This is a crisis, and it's great that an organization saw fit to pull everyone together to try and, you know, work together in, through this crisis. So I think we should all give a round of applause to Prudential Rand here tonight. Thank you. What we're going to be talking about during our segment is, is basically um, fraud when it comes to foreclosure. Many of you may be facing foreclosure, and you certainly are a victim at that point. But how do you like to be re-victimized again just when you think things couldn't be getting worse? You've now been served with papers by the bank, or you've been, you learned that the bank is now going to move ahead to foreclose on, uh, foreclose on your loan. You think you've really hit the bottom. You've hit the bottom at that point. But oftentimes, things are just starting because we have, what we have is we have rampant mortgage foreclosure fraud that goes on. Anytime you have a crisis, you see people, predators I call, who are ready to step in and take advantage of somebody's predicament. And that's what we're seeing here in Rockland and across the state and across the country. And that's what we want to talk about today. Um, there's a lot of other mortgage fraud, but we're going to focus primarily on that. In response to that, and it's really sophisticated, it's, um, it's a crime that takes a lot of thinking extensive documents, you have forgeries, you have all types of um, issues that come up. The Sheriff of Rockland County, the Rockland County Clerk, and the Rockland County DA's office have formed a task force called the Real Estate Fraud Investigation Task Force, um, or REFI, which is going to be focusing in on um, mortgage and real estate fraud. It's, the reason we're, for, we're joining forces is because we're tapping the best resources from the three offices the investigative prowess of the sheriff's department and his detectives, the county clerk's office that really is the repository for all the documents that are at the basis of mortgages and fraud and what have you, and they see the trends coming in. In the DA's office, which are we have assigned um, specialized prosecutors, auditors, and investigators to really uh, attack, this, attack this type of fraud. We have to be smart. We have to outsmart the criminals. We have to try and stay ahead of the curve because it is sophisticated. It's not, it's not solving a simple burglary. Um, you have to really have some foresight. So we're going to work together to try and make a real dent in that in Rockland County. Um, I don't know if either one of you want to comment on that. 